Where to start with Google SEO? There are three parts to Google SEO. On-site SEO, off-site SEO, and technical SEO. On-site SEO includes things like keyword optimization, optimizing titles and tags, and creating content. Off-site SEO is everything you do outside of your website or channel, like backlink building, citation building, social media backlink building, and more. Technical SEO covers things like website speed and all technical aspects. We will discuss each of these three parts in detail in later videos. It is believed within the SEO industry that Google uses around 250 ranking factors to rank a website. These range from on-site SEO factors like using the right keywords in the right areas of your website, creating great content on your site or YouTube, to technical SEO like page load speed of your website, and off-site factors like how many backlinks or directory links are pointing to your website. There are so many factors to optimize for, and over the duration of this course, I will do my best to elaborate as much as possible on the factors in my experience that are most important and carry the most weight. It's also important to know that Google often change the goalposts when they update what is known as the Google algorithm. Experts believe that these updates happen around 500 to 600 times per year, or once or twice a day. However, some of Google's algorithms are very well known and much bigger than your typical small update. In fact, so big that a lot of sites see a huge increase or decrease in ranking positions. Some of the main updates are the Florida update, the Panda update, the Penguin update, RankBrain, and most recently the Google Core Vitals updates. However, most changes are much smaller and some Google algorithm updates even go completely unnoticed because their search engine result page's impact is so low. Know your purpose and Google's purpose. Before getting started on any SEO campaign, it is important to understand the purpose of what you're trying to achieve in alignment with Google's purpose for showing websites, products, services, and relevant information to searchers' queries. Firstly, Google, YouTube, or any other search engine always have the search engine in mind and they want to show them the most best matching search results. And along with this, they aim to show the most relevant results as quality is key. Showing good results ensures that the searcher will use their search service going forward into the future. It's important to know as well that search engines like Google depend mostly on ads to generate their revenue. Google, for example, show relevant paid ads at the top of search results pages for search queries. Relevant ads or best matching ads work great for the searcher and the advertiser. If the advertiser is getting good results from the ads, they keep coming back to run more ads and Google generate more revenue and likewise, the searcher is happy that Google is helping them find exactly what they need. So again, always, when you are doing your SEO campaign, you need to keep the searcher in mind and make sure that you know that relevance is key. You want to make sure you're optimizing for keyword search terms that your exact audience are looking for to find products and services like yours.